guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 2 of Senio Girls. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Really, are you sleeping at a time like this? No, he's asleep. I figured that was his sister. Angie. Hot and white. I didn't notice that the first time I saw this opening. Girl got a god dang freaking drawing um <laughs> sketchbook. <laughs> and as her face, like the new girl from freaking Love Live. <laughs> I didn't even not notice that the first time. <laughs> Oh god. I'm not gonna use that. Yet. Mm. How to make aging more popular. I mean aging maybe you should just no, that's not gonna work. Kinda yeah mm, aging, you think you're a nice person? I have a ranking list. <laughs> and Nakano has number one. Just because you like him, honey. <laughs> you just, you naturally do it, so you won't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's so sweet. No, AZ, you're sweet. I mean, it's nice that you give Nanako the bigger half. <laughs> I think I just found best girl or my second best girl. So, but Poto is the lotus. Nani? 
You wouldn't think that someone like her would be in that type of club, but okay. Damn. Look at him, they look so cute. <laughs> oh, are you hungry? Oh, that looks so good. Even though I had a chicken sandwich and some fries. <laughs> good. Are you still hungry? Oh. Why would you say that to her? That's so mean. Mama. I love the fact that her dad is freaking panicking right now. <laughs> because typically all dads usually do that when a girl starts to diet. My dad did it. <laughs> no, no, I think you're fine just the way you are. AG. Oh, I thought she was going to say run, but like, mm-mm. I have a feeling she's going to like, oh, okay, never mind. I thought she was going to like crash into her boobs. Christ, woman. That's all. <laughs> She's the best girl now. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. Nanako loves you. You just haven't figured it out yet. Nanako. <laughs> Feel my stomach is a chubby. Well, describe it. <laughs> Amane, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, <cut him. laughs> oh, I can't. That face.
Ja. No, you like him too, so he's not your brother. You consider him your brother, but you're just friends. Or maybe he's adopted? Or she's adopted? No, you're friends, but you just treat him like a little brother. Mm -hmm. Big sister. But I bet you someone else is going to come for her. I mean, it, but it's obvious. Like, Nanako loves Adrian. And they just look so cute together. And I feel like they're going to be partnered up. They're going to, we're going to have our Yuri. Our Yuri. Now I just need a Yaoi in this anime, too. But I'm guessing we're not going to get no guys love, no boys love today <laughs> in this series. Because <laughs> it's only one dude. And how many girls are like, what, six, seven of them? But I mean, Amane and Koto, they look cute together. I mean, I like the, and this is always me in anime, it's the height difference between the male and the female characters, or even the Yuri characters or the Yaoi characters, because it just looks right. And it's just like, when they kiss, you already know one's going to have to like stand on their tippy toes and the other one's going to have to bend down because it's just right. But I mean... Nanako didn't have to go on a diet. <laughs> oh my god, yes. Nanako didn't have to go on a diet. I mean, she's... She's a pretty girl. And typically, I, mean, I can't believe he said that to her. It's just like, when a guy says that, like, your whole world just ends... I mean, like, to me, sometimes I feel like AG just thinks that Nanako is just one of, like, a guy's gal, where he can literally talk about any random guy-ish around her, and then she's just looking there like, hmm? Hmm? Okay, well, yeah, that's just normal. Or, like, he says something about, like, farting or whatever, and then she's just like, did he really just say that? <laughs> I mean, as someone who is also a guy's gal, I mean, it is weird when, well, no, at first it was weird when guys would just start that conversation and you're just sitting here and you're like, you know, I'm a girl, right? Yeah, I'm the only fucking girl right here, duh. And, uh, but eventually, like, naturally, later on, down the line, you're okay with it. It's just like, mm, okay. They, they sit in here talking about dicks and then when you with your girlfriend, you just talk about, you know? All that stuff with your girls. Because it's just natural. We all talk about it. It's a bit, it's just too cute. I mean, and what I'm hoping for the next episode is, because, like, kind of what I was hoping with this one, even though with it 12 minutes, um, <laughs> freaking Koto. <laughs> they would have worked out more, like, went on a run. She would have did some push-ups. She did one sit-up, which was cute. was, like, adorable as hell. At least she tried. Like, that's the honest thing. Like, you know, give her a participation award because <laughs> Nanako tried her hardest and she's just too precious. Like, let her go, like... <laughs> go walk or take a jog somewhere. Don't have her do all the strength training stuff. We don't need her to get all buff out. I mean, you know. <laughs> I mean, Koto, she's already buffed kind of with, you know, the club that she's in. I mean, seriously, honestly, who would have freaking thought that this girl would have been <laughs> in that type of club? I'm so but I, I do like the fact that she does have a crush on him, too. And I'm guessing one by one, all these girls, which I think it is, like, what, six? Or it's either five or six girls. I'm going to have to sit and count over again. They're all going to have a crush on him. And in the end, AG is just going to pick Nanako. Because he has feelings for Nanako, too. It's just, it's obvious. Because 
why in the you can tell that him and Nanako have so much chemistry. And it's just obvious. Come on. It, it, it works. That's all. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction to you towards episode two of Send Me a Girl. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Mattress Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially next Friday for episode three. Bye, guys.